Now, last season, we had a very, very mid-season. Even though I led the league in receiving yards with 1,656 and 14 receiving touchdowns. And because of the crazy season I had, I ended up getting offered the rookie of the year. And the Chiefs ended up winning the Super Bowl. Y'all can see the other awards. If you didn't watch my rookie year movie, you should probably go ahead and watch that before you watch this. After not making the playoffs while having an amazing rookie season, it really got me worked up because, like, I was putting all the work and we still end up falling short. But the good thing is, though, is that we actually, since we didn't make the playoffs, we ended up with a pretty decent pick and we ended up trading up in the draft in order to draft Drake May. And other than Drake May, really, that's the only addition that we got to our team. For some reason, the, the, the GM front office and them, they, they decided that I guess our receiving core was good enough, that our O-line was good enough, that we had the good tight end. Like, they, they didn't go out and get anything. We just got Drake May, so we'll see how this goes. But we're having a new quarterback in Drake May. Hopefully, he has a way better season than Matt Jones did last year. And as long as I go crazy, as I know I'm going to do, we'll be able to make the playoffs just, you know what I'm saying, run the offense through me. And, you know, we'll be good. But for some reason, even though I had that great of a season, analysts and critics still believe that we won't be able to make the playoffs. But I'm going to have to go ahead and prove them wrong this year. Me and Drake May, we finna go crazy. And for the first game of the season, it's going to be a very, very tough matchup against the 49ers. A great defense. But you know what I'm saying? I believe that with a new quarterback and, you know what I'm saying, I done broke out already. We still have a pretty decent chance. Drake May's first pass and play, and he runs a play ash and getting the ball to Juju and just look at me blocking. Hey, man, I'll be doing my thing. On third down, running a little slant route to get this first down, and I'm getting a little bit of yards extra. If me and Drake May, you know what I'm saying, go ahead and build up this chemistry early, ooh-wee, it's going to be nasty. Second and 11, they're in the cover three, and the perfect play was called. I run the in route, getting the first down, going down with it. Now, with us playing against the 49ers, we already know their defense is great, and their pass rush is what makes their defense as good as it is. Second the rookie, and the one of our old linemen that getting injured. Bad business. And when you're on third and 17, and you got to try to be able to hold the ball for a while, against this D-line, you cannot do that. He had to try to take a check down. It was inaccurate. Got to go for the field goal. Beginning of the third quarter, we're down 14 to 6, so we got some coming back to do. I'm doing a streak, but I ended up coming back because I saw that DB was playing too far ahead. Got an easy first down. On first and 10, this DB was playing way too far off of me. I'm doing a post route, getting the ball in the middle of the field, getting an easy first. We done had a pretty good drive so far, but we're in this play action really messed us up, and I'm getting sacked for about 8 yards. And at this point, it looks like we might have to just go ahead and go for the field goal. Drake May trying to throw the ball, but end up getting deflected. 14 to 9, and we got the ball. So we have a chance to go ahead and take the lead. I'm getting this easy catch for the first down. We're taking our time with this drive. Drake May's throwing the ball to the running back, and he's getting jiggy getting that first down. And the goal line, they're in a weird defense, and you know, I was open, but a tight end was open too. Touchdown, either way it go. They end up scoring and getting two, so we're losing 22 to 15. We need to get some points this drive. That ball was almost overthrown, but that receiver made a great catch to get that touchdown. Juju Smith Schuster. Defense got a huge stop. It's a tie game, and I'm killing this DB off the press, and I'm wide open down the field catching the ball, and he's not gonna be able to catch me. We taking this lead. Defense gonna hang it a stop so we can win this game. That's exactly what they did. Clutch game right here for the first game of the season. Beating the 49ers the way we just did. It's pretty good. Drake May's NFL debut. He's already looking like a young superstar. 372 yards and three touchdowns, no picks. That's crazy. And I end this game with 160 yards on six catches with a touchdown. And Juju also had a pretty good game. Drake May keep on performing like this. We're going to be good. Now, I guess it still is another very good defense. And I'm getting open in the middle of the field. He's throwing that ball perfectly to me. So I can make the catch and get the first. After a dot like that, you wouldn't expect him to throw an incomplete pass like this. That was just a duck. That would have been a wide open. He probably could have made that touchdown. And it'll make it no better that on second and 10, them D linemen done got off that line and got him for about eight yards. Third and long, I'm running the crossing route and I was wide open. But guess what? One of the defensive players bumped into me, so I wasn't able to get to that ball. I'm surprised no flag was called or anything. That's crazy. 
We weren't even in field goal range either, so that was bad. So now we're down zero to seven, and he just threw that ball completely behind me. I don't know what's going on. Pretty big third down because we got a score to drop, and he's getting a wide open receiver in the middle of the field. There we go, man. Let's go ahead and get something here. I'm in the slot on first and 10. He's throwing the ball right to me, right over that linebacker, and I'm trying to get that touchdown, but I'm one yard short. I guess we got to run it in. And that's exactly what we do. Ramondre Stevenson getting in there for an easy touchdown. I mean, now the offense starting to get rolling. Dre May got pressure on him. He's running to the right side and he accurately throws that ball to me somehow. And I'm taking the hit, still making the catch for the first. With all the passing that Drake may have been doing, I guess the Steelers forgot that he had legs on him and look at me clearing the way for him. He ends up getting a big gain as I knock two DBs down for him. Second and 10, he's gonna throw me the ball quickly over that linebacker again, just like he did last time. We're getting the first down easily. One thing I like about Drake May is that he is accurate and patient at the same time. He waited for me to get open in between them zones and put it right there where it needed to be. Here on third and two, he throws the ball and puts it right where the receiver can catch the ball, but somehow the ball ended up getting intercepted. Like, you couldn't catch the ball? Like, what's going on, bro? That's his first pick of his NFL career, and it wasn't even his fault. All right, man, last job was unfortunate, but it's good. Our defense is playing amazing, so it's still a tied game. Let's go ahead and put together a little drive. We're on third down again, and there's an open receiver, but Drake May's not able to get it to him because of that D-line getting to him. That pressure's crazy. He had to throw a cross body, and it was inaccurate. Great defense again, tie game, and we're in the red zone corner, bro. He's throwing the ball to me to the sideline. That's a dot, but they called it out of bounds. So you already know coach had to go ahead and challenge that play because obviously I had my two feet in, and that's a touchdown. Nice. The defense, our defense is playing right now in this game is crazy. We're up 17 to 10. They end up getting another stop. And now we finna go ahead and score again. We end up burning the clock out, getting the field goal, winning 20 to 10. 2 and 0, starting off the season pretty good. Crazy, Drake May's already having a better season than Matt Jones was last year. He Pretty good game, a touchdown. He should have had a touchdown. I mean, y'all saw it. That pick wasn't his fault, and I had another great game. And I guess they took away my touchdown from the challenge play. I don't know what's going on. We, we scored, right? Game three against the Seahawks, and they've been having a pretty good defensive season, but we do not care. Drake May throwing that ball over that DB's head. Perfect pass, first down. That was nice. They got to third and four. He's throwing the ball to the receiver who should have been able to get this first down, but he was not able to fourth and inches. Run the RPO, and he should have thrown the slant to me, but instead he handed the ball off, and we somehow did not get the first down. However, that happened. We're down 14 to zero. I don't know how we got in this hole, but Dre May is not being smart right now. He threw that ball up to a running back, to a running back. And I beat this DB off the press and he threw the ball behind me. It's one of these rookie games, man. He's gonna make rookie mistakes. All right, man, defense got to stop, so we're still in this game. He tried to throw the ball to me on a streak, but he ended up getting sacked immediately. Second and 17, and his tight end was wide open. Wide open for the first down, but he dropped the ball. What are you supposed to do after that? I don't know if DB's going to learn or not, but if you press me, I'm way faster than you. I'm killing them off the press, and it was overthrown. <sighs> That's tough. Now we find ourselves on third and 10, and he's trying to get the ball to a receiver on the right side of the field. I can't see him, though, and it's incomplete. The game that we're having right now on offense, we do not deserve the defense right now because they're just locking up and just giving us all the chances that we need to win this game. Here comes a big play that we need. We need to score the drive. We keep finding ourselves on third down, but this time he's throwing me the ball on the slant, and I'm securing this catch while taking the hit. Now I run the RPO, and he's throwing the ball to Devontae Parker, who's wide open on his route. Touchdown. But we're in a very, very bad place right now. We're down 7-20. to 20. If we don't find a way to score this drive, this game is basically over with. And this big play right here was very much needed. Running verticals on 2nd and 10 in the open tight end. Drake May puts that ball right where it needs to be to score this touchdown. Come on, defense. Y'all been doing it all game. Get another one. Well, defense tried. It's our fault we lost this game. 20-14. In our first loss of the season, Drake May still had a pretty good game. Like, two touchdowns, no picks. He's accurate. Caleb Williams is also on the Seahawks. I wouldn't say he had a better game than Drake, but he did win. And another great game for me. Five catches, 125 yards, no touchdown. But 
we lost, so does that really matter? Coming into the week four matchup against the Bills, unfortunately, Ramondre Stevenson will not be able to play as he's out for the game with a quad strain. That's definitely going to take a toll on our running game because we got Zeke as a backup, but he's definitely not the Zeke he used to be. A pass game is going to have to be a lot better. And the passing game starting off is not looking too bad. I'm running this nasty route, getting past this cornerback, and Drake May is putting that ball right there, right where it needs to be. What a crazy pass and what a crazy catch to get to first and goal. We're actually coming out here in five. Why did I'm standing there right at the touchdown? He's giving me the ball for my touch. I don't know what's going on, but we keep on finding ourselves on third down, but at least we're getting the conversions. We just gotta find a way to not keep getting third downs, cause like, you know? That boy Drake May is really showing off his arm talent in this game. The way he just putting that ball where it needs to be. Andrew Davis White was guarding Juju on that play and still got did in. Nasty. Now Zeke gonna run the ball on second and 10 and getting in there for the touchdown. I'm laying that safety out. And here we are again on third and four, and guess what we doing? We converting, getting the out route, first down. I'm running the drag route on first and 10. He's throwing me the ball, and I'm getting hit by two defenders, and I still found a way to make this catch. On third down again, he gave the ball to Juju, but there was no forward progress, so we was not able to get the first down. We got tackled behind. At this point, on their side of the field, why wouldn't we go for it on fourth and two, and I'm securing this catch while taking the hit? Now, when they seen us in this formation, they should have never stayed in man coverage because I killed this DB on the corner route. It's bad business for them. All right, now, fourth quarter, we're only up 21 to 16. I did a curl route, a little stop route to get the first down, and that ball was nowhere near thrown to me. Because of that, now we're down three points. We got to put together a money drive, and he got that ball over that DB. That was a nice pass. Third down again for like the hundredth time in this game. Getting it to the tight end, and he just dropped the ball. <sighs> we need number one receiver on the team. You got to be aware of what your quarterback wants you to do. I'm on an end route, but I end up coming back to the left side because I saw him scrambling to the left side so I can get this first down. Starting to get on the same page. I mean, it seems like we've been on the same page since the first game. Now, with this play right here, he might as well go ahead and get that Offensive Rookie of the Year award. The way he put that ball right there for Juju, and then he even got a rough in the passer call, just for reassurance. But it was a touchdown, so, you know, we're declining it. We're taking this lead. Man, what a game-winning touchdown by Drake May to Juju. Just nasty. And I'd say he outperformed Josh Allen in this game. Three touchdowns and zero picks. Josh Allen only had two. He had 300 passing yards, which wasn't even that much off of Josh Allen. He's playing like a superstar. In this stretch of games, I've been having nine catches, 143 yards, and two touchdowns. And Juju also had a great game again. Like, this one-two combo is looking nice. And Drake May looking like offensive rookie of the year. I mean, at this point, it's looking like he might get more than just that. Because look at our stats through four weeks. I'm number one in receiving yards, and he's number one in passing yards. And in this next game in week five, it's gonna show if he's really him. Is he really that X Factor? 